What is SEEDS? Um, so it's all about trying to find the fastest route to zero emissions in shipping or towards zero emissions in shipping because this is a journey. SEEDS is basically an infrastructure for offshore fueling and the fueling of green fuels. We think about this a lot, but we've, I've never thought about refueling ships at sea. The SEEDS project is, is quite exciting and I think the feedback so far from the partners that it has all been very, very valuable. We learn from each other, we are having knowledge that we weren't really aware we were having and when you put all together something amazing happens. This project was presented as a kind of initiative where all those companies got together and saying we are going to create something. One year later now we see that they have come up with a good idea, a good project. The engagement of the partners has been fantastic. All the people is given their utmost and they're feeling the strength of the cooperation together. I think it's very groundbreaking. On HFO you can have much more mileage. So if you have less mileage on, on renewable energy sources, you have to find a way how to fuel it. So I think this is really like a missing link to try to solve the problem to go to renewable fuels. We are at the very early stage of this concept development, so bringing in new partners will be necessary and that's, that's really what we're looking for now. I think it's partners that are maybe more specialised in clean fuel. It's partners that can also help us on the legislation side. So we probably also would need to, like to involve some, uh, some NGOs or maybe government. But we need more partners in to bring more knowledge to make it a reality. We're definitely at the beginning of this journey and Zeeds was a very important first step along the way. We kind of were able to formulate a vision together of what it could look like in the future in that zero emissions world. Norway's been a leader in this area, you're, you know, you're introducing zero emission zones. We think that you know, they are the key to moving forward. You don't start with trying to decarbonize the largest ships in the world. You start small and you work and develop solutions from there. And this is exactly what these companies have been doing as a group, looking how you could refuel at sea um, small ships. And if you can do that for them, then you can scale up. Will this idea be realized? I, I do hope so, and that's why we went on this journey, but uh, I think you, you could ask me maybe five years later, because it's not something that you would build tomorrow, but it's definitely something that we believe is possible with today's technology.